we will be adding three digit numbers with regrouping using base 10 blocks. First, let's start by modeling the equation 348 plus 234 using our base 10 blocks. First, let's build 348. 348 has three hundreds, four tens, and eight ones. Now let's build 234 using our base 10 blocks. 234 has two hundreds, three tens, and four ones. Now because we're super smart mathematicians, we have to organize our base 10 blocks in rows of 5 because that makes them easier to count. So let's start with our 1's. Now that we have our 1's organized in rows of 5, let's look at our 10's. Now that our tens are organized in rows of five, let's organize our hundreds. So now that we have our blocks organized, this leaves us with five hundreds, seven tens, and twelve ones. <coughs> we can't have twelve ones, so that means we need to do something different. What we need to do is called regrouping. This means that we need to regroup 10 ones and trade them for one 10. So let's look at how this happens. We're going to trade 10 ones and regroup them into one 10. So after we have traded 10 ones, for one ten, this leaves us with five hundreds, eight tens, and two ones. So the sum of our equation, 348 plus 234, is 582. Next, let's draw a representation of a three-digit addition problem with regrouping. Let's look at the equation 314 plus 267. We'll start by drawing the number 314 using blue. 314 has three hundreds, one ten, and four ones. Next, let's draw 267 using pink. 267 has two hundreds, six tens, and seven ones. This leaves us with five hundreds, seven tens, and eleven ones. But we can't have eleven ones, so that means that we need to regroup. Let's take ten of the ones and trade them for one ten. Now that we have regrouped or traded ten ones for one tens, we now have five hundreds, eight tens, and one one. This means that the sum of 314 plus 267 is 581. Woohoo! Flex your math muscles because you are super smart mathematicians and are awesome at adding three digit numbers with regrouping. Thanks for watching. You can stay connected to our class 
by following us on Twitter at aklewis1147, hashtag school on fire, or by visiting our website at eisthirdgrade.webs.com.